Hello, everybody. Thank you for the first successful day of our annual Bridges meeting. I hope you all had a good experience. There were a couple of messages that the presenters wanted me to convey to you in preparation for tomorrow. One, we did have a technical issue with one of the posters who was unable to present today. That poster number 27 has been rescheduled to tomorrow morning's poster session number three, which begins at 10 a.m. and it will be poster number nine. Um, and just a reminder to all of you who are presenting posters tomorrow to please go ahead and log into the Zoom account that was created for you and test your link and make sure it's there and that it works and that you're using that account and not your personal Zoom account tomorrow so that you're able to scare, share your screen. If any of you do have problems tomorrow, go ahead and use the technical support feature on the main uh, meeting website that you see in the chat box when you open that up. With that out of the way, I just wanna thank give thanks again to everybody today for some wonderful scientific sessions as well as our patient advocacy para, uh, panel. It's very interesting learning this morning about how stem cells and regenerative medicine applications can be applied to help us understand the basis of novel and emerging diseases, as well as to begin to dissect the pathological basis of some conditions that have confounded us for many years, including autism. And learning about these new tools such as organoids and the newest applications of them, including the uh, organoid controlled robots, I found that very exciting. And uh, I am just looking forward to see the new things that this field is going to bring us in the future. And I also want to give my heartfelt thanks to Yemi Via, who organized our wonderful patient advocacy panel, as well as our patient participants. It's always very important to hear their perspectives. And I think it came loud and clear that even those of you who are not planning to go to medical school, and I think a lot of, of you are intending to stay in science, it's still really important for us to understand the perspective of patients and some of the experiences that patients go through, because it's not just about compassion, it's about understanding their needs and engineering those needs into the science from as early as possible so that we can help as many people down the road as we can. And tomorrow, uh, hopefully everybody will get to sleep in just a little bit. The first session starts at 10 a.m. with poster session number three, and then we'll be looking forward to our third and final scientific session on cancer stem cells, followed by an alumni panel where you'll get to hear about what's become of some of our Bridges alumni that I <laughs> were part of a large number of individuals I mentioned on my slide today. You'll get to hear some of their stories. And with that, I think uh, I've concluded today's business, and we look forward to seeing all of you tomorrow morning. Thank you.